I've been Claritin Clear for seven days. At the first sign of my allergies, my doctor recommended taking one Claritin every day of my allergy season for continuous relief. 16 days. 26 days of continuous relief. Live Claritin Clear every day. Clara is with Mr. Enrique Iglesias. Thank you, Ginger. Get on up here, Ginger, by the way. Right, Enrique? Yes. Good morning to you. That was amazing. Thank you very much. I want to brag about you just a little bit. This man right here just Making rocked the already. park. Everyone dancing to Bailando. And, of course, that's to be expected from Enrique, who's got more number one Billboard dance hits. I did not know this. Than any other male artist, including Michael Jackson and Prince. That's that's crazy. That's unbelievable. Um, I, I'm so happy. I'm so fortunate. And thank you to the fans for making it out here so early in the morning. And it's getting hot, humid. It, it's hot. It's good dancing weather. It's perfect it to have you here. Everybody was so excited. I want to talk to you about Bailando. It means dancing, as everybody knows. Um, skyrocketing up Billboard's Hot 100. But you told Billboard around the time that your album came out, which is called Sex and Love. Uh, it's pretty... That, very straightforward. Yeah, yeah, it's very cool. What is the album about? Uh, no, um, you, but you told Billboard that you had to fight to get on top 40 stations. I don't think that's a problem anymore. I mean, you always got to fight. I always feel that every single I put out is like, I look at it like it's my first single. And every song is a fight. And eventually, if my fans love it, thankfully this album they love, they love the song. So I'm so ecstatic. But every song is a fight. So let's talk about that title. Let's talk about the sex album. and love. It's it's pretty self-explanatory. There's there's songs that talk about sex. There's songs that talk about love. There are two words that can be so close together, but yet so far apart. Yes, and in one of those songs, which uh, well, I don't I don't know. You tell us. Um, it's a little ditty called "I'm a Freak" with <laughs> with Pitbull. That, that was not one of the love songs. No, but I I love that. The first time I heard that on the radio, I was like. This is a different Enrique. I know what you said. I'm a freak. <laughs> I was wondering if I was a freak because I liked it so much. It, it's, it's, it's in a positive way. It's a fun song. That's a cool thing about music. It's, there's no rules. You can do whatever you want. And when you write songs, it, it could be a fantasy or it could be something that's going on in your life that's serious. Yep. But that's a cool thing. There's really no rules. Yeah, and it does get you moving and evokes emotion. Your arena tour with the one and only Pitbull, who we love here on GMA, starts... It starts next month. I guess they'll all be there. What can we expect from the arena tour? I love our fans. Aren't they the best? Uh, the arena tour is going to be unbelievable uh, with Pit. Pitbull is a good friend of mine. Whenever we go on tour, we always have a good time. And the fans, uh, the fans can expect a great fun show for those two, three, four hours that we're going to be up on stage. We just want them to have a good time, forget about the bad times, and just, just go crazy. Yeah. All right. Sound good, everybody? It all begins next month. The Arena Tour in Newark, New Jersey, right around the corner. Yes, ma'am. So, and, uh, and coming up, everybody, Enrique will perform a classic. So don't go anywhere. Enrique on Good Morning America.